Okay, welcome back. Uh, in a previous video, we showed you how to upload, activate, and uh, use the WordPress landing pages plugin. Um, in this video, I want to show you a little bit about how to edit your text um, to take advantage of all the features of the WordPress landing pages plugin. So, um, this is really just a pretty basic WordPress. Uh, text editing um, video, but uh, first thing I'm going to show you is we're on the same page here that we were on in the previous video. I'm just going to click this little icon down here to kind of open up to give me more room to view my text, and you can do that within any WordPress um, post or page editor. And we can see all we have here is text, and we have this one little image within our um, block of text. Now, the one thing that you'll um, want to make note of is, you know, this particular page, if we look at it using the default template from the theme, let me update that, and we go back to the page, we'll notice the what is identity theft, this is what we named our uh, page, this was the page title, shows up here at the beginning, and then all of our text shows up. Now, if we go back and we edit it to use one of the templates, um, and we'll use the Recycler template as our demo, and we hit Update, we'll notice, and we go back and view, we'll notice that that page title is not um, showing up, and that's intentional. Uh, we want to give you the flexibility to put whatever headline you want to put on um, your landing page title. And the way you do that is, let's go back to our text editor, and we'll add a um, sentence that says, you know, what is identity theft? Question mark. And then we'll we'll add another headline right below it that says, um, what any uh, person should know. It's a pretty bad headline, but it'll work for our demo. So, okay. Now, so this is gonna be our main headline. This is gonna be our secondary headline, and then we'll just have our text and our images still in there. Um, so we'll just go ahead and highlight uh, the text. Well, first thing we want to do is we'll notice here we're just using the basic text editor that comes uh, pre-installed with WordPress. Um, but what you need to do is you need to hit this little icon down here at the very end. It's called the, the kitchen sink, and that will show us the, the additional text editing options. And now you can see it opens up a lot of different choices down here for us. So now we'll, we'll highlight our text, or our uh, title, our, our headline for the article. And then we come up here to where you see this word paragraph in this drop down, and we're just going to choose one of these bigger headline options, and we'll just use headline one to start. And then on the second one here, we'll use headline two, just to kind of as an example. Um, and since these are headlines for the site, it might look cool if they were centered. So we'll go ahead and highlight both of those and hit this button here to align center. These are these tools up here are very similar to what you would use in Microsoft Word if you were editing a document. So let's go ahead and hit update and just see what that looks like. And now we'll view page and we can see now we have a headline and a subheadline and then we lead into our text. Um, we can go back and change the template and take a look and see how that looks using a different template. And you'll notice these headline uh, look different on each one because each one's using different fonts and things in their style sheets. So, um, you know, there's a lot of different things you can do there. We'll we'll look at one more here. Um, come back over, take a look at it, and see headline different headline, and then the text. So, um, you know, that's a cool way that you can add, uh, you know, some some different editing to your to your sales page or landing page. Uh, coming back down here into the text, uh, you, you can edit it just like you can in any other WordPress, uh, but just in case we've got some uh, newbies here, we'll show them some of the ways that you can edit text. So we'll come down here and maybe make a couple of sentences and we'll highlight these and you can come back up and use the bold button, and, or I'm sorry, the bullets button, make some bu a bulleted list, maybe move this image down a little bit, hit update come back over and now let's view it again. Now we've added some bullet points uh, to our sales page. If we wanted to make this um, second sentence here like a quote, like it was a quote from a customer or something, we highlight all of that and we click the quote button and it's going to put that in a quote section. And we'll come back over there and we'll go ahead and change back to the recycler template so we can see what that looks like come back over and now we've got this quote here you know from maybe a customer or a 
testimonial or something like that that we could have put in there. Um, there's lots of other things you can do. You can add images in if you're a paying customer. Uh, you can take advantage of our uh, sales page graphics, buy now buttons, add to cart buttons, uh, um, guarantee certificates and things like that that come as a bonus with our product and you can insert those right into your sales letter. Um, you can you can hyperlink text, you know. I mean this is these are basic WordPress things, but just so you'll know you could click this and add in a link that you wanted to well, that's horrible spelling. Uh, you know now we've linked that particular keyword and um, I would encourage you to go out and research online to see uh, the various WordPress text editing uh, options that are available to you. Um, in a future video, we may discuss some additional plugins that you can use to even get more functionality for your text editing for your sales and landing pages. Uh, those include uh, free WordPress plugins like the Tiny MCE Advanced plugin or the FCK Editor plugin. Um, and we'll show some of the things that you can do with those. But uh, anyway, that ends this video.